Anyway, let's move on from there. So Tinubu is the chairperson. And now, he, in effect, I mean, from all the news that has been said, Nigeria is charging the cost of ECOWAS to invade Niger. I mean, we, we call it Niger. That, that's what we used to call it when we were young. I mean, uh, I still call it Niger anyway, but it said Niger. Because the military took over. I mean, they're calling it a coup. No, let's stop it calling it a coup. The military intervened. The military acted on behalf of the people. Now, the hot seat, we are not in support of military operations and interventions from within the sub-region. But the fact remains, the military of any given country is set up to defend the country, the people, both domestically and internationally. As said in our previous video, that is the fundamental disposition of the military. So if domestically, the military thinks that the country, the people's resources, assets, livelihood is under threat, is being siphoned with nothing to show for it and therefore acted, do we call it a coup? It's military takeover. It's military intervention in civilians robbing, looting the resources of the country in association, alliance with other nations. Now let's come back. It is in the news that France is not so happy about the military taking over in Niger because of their interest. The, the, the share volume of uranium that Niger has and does supply France. Now, we've said it before, look, Africa, or most of the African sub-region, is seen by the West as a resource, natural resource hub, nothing else. 